Hello, welcome to another video today. Today we're going to be reviewing three pieces of new Devastator. Um, these pieces, the newer ones, heard bad reviews on the other ones. The little guy is terrible. Like, all that stuff. But so far we got the pieces that are already out. Um, Rampage, which is a leg, the leg piece. Then you have High Tower. I always thought it was kind of funny how he's supposed to be an elbow on one side and then the other side's just a whole arm. Long Call, which is another foot piece. Now this foot's way too big. Like, honestly, that's almost as big as my feet. <laughs> Warning, three of them were easy, but this one, the main headpiece, just got it today. It was terrible. It was, like, way too hard. But, like, he, as you can see down here, And it has to clip on under the clip. I only have the four pieces because the well the um overhaul comes out let's see mid twenty twenty. The other one the uh let's see, I got instructions to the one up and that tells me everything. Um Let's see, I have Mixed Master, Long Call, Rampage, High Tower. Scrap Metal comes out in one to two more weeks. Scavenger comes out in two to three months. Construction Scrapper comes out, let's see, I think that one comes out um, early 2020. So probably next month. It looks like the ones that are not out yet are marked. I don't know if y'all can see that. It's kind of weird. But right here it shows overload marked two. Like, right here, it shows the low dash is released 2019, available early 2020, which is Mark 1, slash, available late 2020. Ooh, that's not good. I'd have to wait almost a whole entire 2020 just to complete the newer Devastator. Because the one that you can buy that's still big as that one, still's not gonna be that great. <laughs> Because, well, it's, it's almost, it, one of them rates from 500 with bad reviews. The one that's a $1,000 rates pretty good. But, well, yeah. <laughs> By the way, I got some other ones I wanted to show in this as well. Uh, sorry. I like to use this one, this call, to go all the way back. So it can hold him up. Because he doesn't want to stand, he's so top heavy. And his feet are so weak. And his knees don't want to bend. Did y'all see that? Yeah, that one's, um, uh, Bone Crusher. The one that basically gets his face smashed in from Optimus. And then I have a few other ones. Not really as 
great. This one's blade got bent. I wonder how. <sighs> but it's the newer Bumblebee movie one. The one that came in that $60 pack. No, I don't know what's on the screen right now. It's weird. But yeah, I can't get him transformed. He's kind of a pain in my butt. See, he's got that blade. He's got a little mini gun on him. And then you got normal bumblebee. He has his gun, I just can't remember where I placed it. Oh, there it is. I have a, it came with a little baggie to put everything in. And last but not least, I have more of the um last night and um those had the dinosaurs and stuff. But I remember this dude was like I wanna say fifty. He was my favorite out of all of them. A lot bigger than most that I have. I got used to have a whole bunch, but yeah. <laughs> but I can't give you an estimate amount on how much the whole Devastator crew is going to cost. And the estimate's not going to be that cheap. Now, Mixmaster here on Amazon, it was, I want to say, $29.99. Phone call, I've seen him for, the dump truck, I've seen him for around 30 40 All depends on where you go. Amazon's cheap sometimes, so, hate to say it like that, but it's true. <laughs> What the heck? The tire's not. I might transform these these ones all the way back, but Rampage here is around I want to say twenty nine ninety nine, like the Mixmaster. High Tower was one that was smaller, Just not as great. He's basically a good piece of the character itself because you have to hook him in I want to say like this like put him up like that I don't know if y'all can see that but right there is the piece you slide it in and it locks and then you have this little doohickey right here to snap it so it can move I know I'm doing this way too much but $14.99 all depends on where you live and stuff. It might be a few dollars higher and tax might be a little bit higher. Um, overhaul, judging from what I've heard about him, he's gonna be around, um, I want to say 60 to 70 dollars. For some reason, he's really expensive. Then the big, uh, Will dude, scavenger, he's gonna be forty nine ninety nine to up to eighty dollars from fifty dollars to eighty dollars is the price range. And then scrap metal, he's still a little bit smaller, like um, high tower, but he should be pretty cheap around like so fourteen. $14. The one on Amazon is a lot higher because it's got a few days before it comes out. But another thing, um, 
There's another one I wanted to get to. It's the um scrapper. Scrapper is just like scrap metal, so don't get them confused. But scrapper is one that's gonna be complicated because there's no sign of him or anything and he's mini. He's a mini. So he's gonna be around fifteen to twenty dollars. But Judging from what I've heard, it might be higher for some reason. But he's the whole right side of Devastator's arm. I'll give you a good view of that. But I have four of the eight pieces... Let's see, you're going to probably end up spending, this is a lot cheaper to just buy them, of course, one by one than buying the whole thing together, shockingly. But it's going to cost you 200, 200 to $300 for the whole thing. All depends on like so how much money you're going to put into the pieces. Rather than that, yeah. See ya.